All right, to continue with our piece here, he's looking good. All right, let's work on this body just a little bit. Let's get this thing kind of in tune here. Go ahead and, and uh, start working on these legs. Bring this down just like that. Bring these shoes, just get them rounded off. A lot of people get scared when they do a carving, especially newcomers. They're afraid they're going to take too much off and things like that. And don't be afraid to remove a little bit of wood, thin things out. You got a little bit thinner legs, it's okay. Things don't have to be just perfect. I'm going to go ahead and draw my separation of where my shoes and my uh, pants legs meet. Same thing on the inside here. Getting these shoes down. Now, I, I, I like to make my shoes a little bit flatter than a lot of people do. Okay. Like that. Just 
just similar to that. Alright, as I come up here to my crouch here, as you know, I always make me a little V cut in there. Just like that, see that? Move a little bit more from there. Now I'm gonna I'm gonna thin up this arm just a little bit. Like that. And bring that in just a little bit, just kind of like that. See? Now I'm going to produce my wrinkles in the arm. See? Now my arms might be a little bit uh, bigger than what uh, Ron, excuse me, what Mike does. Same thing back here. I'm going to come with a V-cut. And to this arm over here, same type deal. Now let's go ahead, make our hand come across there. Now you know we're going to have to drill that for the gun, so you don't want to do too much detail on that hand yet, in other words, because it's going to have to be drilled for the gun itself. Bring this back just a little bit. Put the cuts for the arms in here. See that? And kind of thin this up just a little bit. Okay. There we go. Looking good. Now, starting to really take shape now. And what we want. See that? 